everybody welcome to my channel it's eva from bohemian crafting and today i'm coming to share with you what i have created using my uh, latest digital collection australia 26 of january if i'm not mistaken 26 of january was was national day in australia and i have created collection for that day i forgot to share that on my youtube but i did share that on uh, instagram so you were able to see a few pictures and here it's what i have created uh, i did a few openings i used for this creation my new dice and uh, my new embossing folder so new die, <laughs> I've got this scoreboard plus. I always wanted to try these large uh, Bix Sizzix dies. It's that deep dimensional which you can cut the leather and chipboard. And it's really beautiful. I'm not sure if camera it's taking it. Here is cutting pocket, window and half of cover plus flap of cover. Here you can see those parts. And it's designed by Aileen Hull. And that's what I used for cutting a few of these parts. I used inside. And my new embossing folder is this one. Sorry. Is this one. And it's called Ornate Frame. And it's designed by Lisa Jones. And it's really beautiful. It's embossing folder, which has also dies. I was watching Sizzix uh, UK demonstration of new dies and embossing folders and all that new release and i felt in love with this one because it's it's different than others and i really like that so here you can see how it looks when you are using that embossing folder and the dies so i did embossed my front cover i had to move that embossing folder to kind of cover the half which I already embossed with my embossing folder to emboss that rest. So here you can see two of these middle parts. Gonna... So first I embossed this bottom part and then I moved my embossing folder and then I tried to match the pattern here and I embossed it one more time, the half of that cover. I did glued my cover from uh, four pieces actually two outside plus two inside and then I also cut the windows here in the spine and I place there I'm gonna take some white card so you can hopefully will be able to see I place there stickers to kind of create nature and some flowers to put there and here I have placed stickers as well in that window so this is the cover and because I have created these windows in the cover then I went through to all that journal with so many windows you can see through to all these windows so it's kind of like peekaboo peekaboo journal so I will take off the stuff I've got inside you can see through to that pocket I do have pocket here and I do have pocket here And then I do have a window in the flap here, so you can see what is underneath. I've got here this Tim Holtz uh, slot die, and then uh, another pocket. And if you will take off what is in that pocket, you can see through what is underneath. And then it's opening and another pocket with the windows. So it's really so many windows. <laughs> and I did use so many... Uh, dies from Sizzix actually this is Sizzix die as well and same die I used <coughs> pardon me to create windows in my flaps I will point it out when I will be there same die that Tim Holtz die I used for making windows so here I do have opening and pocket window or pocket with window here as well And then pages for writing and they are from that Australian collection and I placed one paper upside down yeah yay <laughs> 
and I do have window in the pocket here so I can see what is in the next pocket then I do have pocket here and I can see through to that pocket what is underneath and here I do have again that Tim Holtz slot <coughs> And for these windows, I use that Tim Holtz slot uh, die, so I can see through. For these windows, this die. And these are from that large scoreboard, scoreboard die, these frames. And this, uh, this pocket I have created created using this die, this piece. So I do have two frames and you can again see through those two frames and I can also see what is happening underneath. And here again pocket with the window so if I will place something inside, and opening here, again a pocket with the window, and I do have another pocket with the window in there. And here these beautiful papers. So pages for writing. And I do have kind of like a window slide spot, which is holding this picture frame or picture, picture page. And I do have pocket here. And flip it over. And I do have another opening here. So I do have again this beautiful picture opening this way. Here we have another pocket and another pocket here with those windows through to that pocket. And another opening here and again I do have that the double pocket with the window opening again large pocket with window and small pocket with window oh come on go there small pocket with window and all these papers which you can see here they are in that collection Australia and again frames So I have to say I had lots of fun with this journal because oh, it's a long time when I <laughs> created so many flaps and openings in this small size. So I did enjoy it so much and we do have opening and here these Tim Holtz uh, slots. And opening here, and again picture and deep pocket, and here I do have belly band, which does have also a window, and I forgot here in this flap, I do have pocket or, or envelope, and with that, behind that envelope I do have another pocket. And here it's one deep pocket and I do have last bunch of papers for writing and few more openings here again Tim Holtz slots this beautiful picture this is uh, Australia star 
the bows and here we do have last opening for this window I used also that Tim Holtz die that slot die so I do have flap with the grass inside and here I do have glued my pocket <laughs> and another pocket so this is all my sharing for today I'm gonna show you very quickly all these designs how they looks like and how my little peekaboo journal looks like and it's just a small inspiration but you can create uh, with your digitals or with the book pages you don't have to have digitals you can use any kind of book pages and just enjoy to do all kinds of openings and pockets and windows. So this is my sharing for today. Thank you so, so much for visiting me today. Thank you so much for spending your time with me. I wish you a beautiful day. Take care about yourself and I will see you soon. Bye.